Well, hail from our recent storms swept through the Central Valley's tree fields, leaving a big mess to the north of us. Hailstones as big as an inch knocked off leaves and even entire limbs destroying fruit. One Tulare County farmer says 150 acres of his ranch were destroyed, and he estimates that to add up to $300,000 in lost profits. And the Tulare Ag Commissioner says the damage has a snowball effect since a smaller crop means less work for pickers and others. Farmers say the full extent of the damage won't be known for weeks, but here in Kern County, we got hit mostly with rain. And as 23 ABC's North County reporter Camilla Bastidas found out, that will be a big money saver for some farmers. Camilla? Kern County was hit with several inches of rain over the past week. Certain areas of the valley floor received one to two inches, while the foothills got three to four. These storms couldn't have come at a better time for some citrus growers. It's a year where in some of our areas, we don't have all the water that we need, where you know, they've cut our allotment down to about, you know, half. Uh, we can get more, but it's going to be very costly. So this was really a big help for us. Gless Ranch grows about 5,000 acres of citrus throughout Kern County. And thanks to the storms, officials will save tens of thousands of dollars. Because we're good for probably a week to two weeks, which uh, that helps tremendously. You know, that's, um, you know, 30, 40, up to $50 an acre savings. Over in Wasco, farm workers tell 23 ABC that it looks like a very promising season for table grapes. Sí, lo, lo puede. Pastor Sanchez says, we didn't have hail here or strong winds, so the leaves didn't break and the tiny grapes are still there. Kern County may have escaped major crop damage this time, but growers aren't always this lucky. Yeah, normally, we're on the other end of it. We've been hurt by the weather way more times, I think, than, uh, than we've got help. This time definitely helped us, but um, it seems like we've been hurt a lot more. Other crops that could have been damaged are the cherry trees because too much rain could make the cherries burst open. In studio, Camilla Bastidas, 23 ABC.